Hi, and welcome to the shed room. Today's machine is the corded uh, hammer drill. I'm gonna go through all the buttons, all the things that it can do, and try to explain how to operate this machine. To start with, we need this plugged in. So that's what we're gonna do. And uh, as I told in the other video about the cordless drill, we also have the power button. Up here we have a speed indicator. On top of this one, we have a selector between drill and hammer drill. And in front here, we have a chuck where we place all our drills and whatever we want to put in. But let's start with the power button, this one. When you squeeze this, it starts the machine. Right here, you can see this indicator right here. Just gonna turn the machine a bit. Right here. If it's located at this side and we squeeze the power button, the machine goes turning. If we put it to the other side, it's gonna go the other way around. So that's either forward or backward. Backward and forward. And the bu on the power button here, right here, there's this small you can turn. If I turn it all the way down, the machine goes really, really slowly. And I can't push it any harder than this. If I turn it all the way around, all the way up, so this is a way of choosing how fast your machine should go. On the side here, you can see a small button as well. This is a way to keep the machine going. So if we push on the power button and then hold. If you push on the power button all the way down and hold it and then push this button, then you can let go of the power button. I'm going to show you in a second uh, when the machine is on, but then I can't really explain how it works because it's noisy. So you push down the power power button, hold that button down, let go of the power button, and let go of this button. I'm going to show it now, then you can see. And uh, when you, as you as you saw, when you want it turned off again, you hold down the power button and then let go, and it's and this small button pushes you out. I'm just going to show it one more time, so you, so you notice that this button button up here, the small one, round one up here, it pops back out when I wanted it turned off. So we're going to try it again. Cool. So now we have a bit of an idea of the power button, the speed uh, selector, 
the direction selector up here in front of the machine there's a one and two and that's a speed selector as well so right now it's on setting one which is the slowest I'm just gonna turn it into this to the setting of two instead So now it's on setting two. This time it goes faster. And you can choose direction, forward and backward. You can also use this, as I showed you before, this indicator. We can turn it all the way down. We can turn it all the way up. So that one can be used in both one and two setting speech setting over here. I'm just going to turn it back again. There go. As you saw, I pushed the power button half the way around because it's it's get it gets stuck in the middle and then you can just lose it by pushing the power button and then you can turn it again yeah on top of the machine as i have shown you before uh, there's a drill as you can see here it's quite hard to see but it's that indication is should be a drill and if I turn it to the other side you might be able to see a small hammer when it sits in drill setting you can use all the other buttons as before but the, the joke out here is only gonna turn as you see here if I push this into the power button, it's, it's, it's still going to turn, but it's also going to hammer. The only way I can uh, show you that is by putting in the drill. It's up here. Turn this one. You can, you can also use the power button to do it. Hold and then... And if I to change the direction, I want forward. If I change the direction, it's going to open. Now it's open. We're just going to take a a drill used for concrete and masonry. Going to put that one in. Change the direction to forward. Hold the chicken on the top. Go slowly. Put the drill in the middle. Do it again. Yep, now we're all the way down. Now we just need a bit of squeeze here. And that's the outer and the inner uh, outer and the inner ring. There we are. The drill is set. So now I can show you the hammer, you can hear the hammer in a second, and you can hear the drill. We're going to start with the hammer, and then I'm going to take this piece of uh, concrete and drill inside of it to listen to the hammering. You can hear it's it banging on it when I, it's turning. I'm just gonna go to the drill, try to do the same. So that's the, the, the difference between drill and the hammer drill is that 
on hammering, it hits as well as it turns. So it turns and it hits back and forward. If it's only drill, it's just going to turn. In front of this machine, I'm just going to put this away for a second. In front of this machine, you got a handle. So you got two handles on this one. You got the one with the power button and all the other buttons. And then you just got an extra handle. That's to make sure that you have a firm grip on the machine. Um, this handle can be turned. As, is, as you see here, the machine is, the handle is turning the same way as the bottom handle. If it, if it turns on this, you loosen it. Here we go. And then we can pull this forward. Then turn. Then tighten it again. So as you know, the handle is from the side instead of downwards. This way you can get a firm grip when drilling in something hard. And you can turn it all the way around as if you want. If you better the other way around with your left hand or you can do that as well. That as well. So now we are on the other side. So just turn and then get it forward, turn it. As you can see up here, there's these pointers here and there's also up here there's the same. You can then make those go fit together. And you can turn whatever kind of setting you want here. Let's squeeze it back again, yeah. So that was the corded hammer drill. Hope to see you back at my channel for more introduction videos on power tools. Please subscribe and give me a like if you want it. And um, see you back at the next video.